Well, it was this one. Okay, that explains last time I slammed this time. So I'm recording on this on the computer. Uh -huh. Which is recording this audio and this video. Uh -huh. This video is back up because that's the video I'm going to use. Okay, cool. Yeah, so it's recording <laughs> on both. We want to watch that video. All right, you ready? It took a lot for you to get ready. No, 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 I'm just kidding. We got lights. We got lights. We got yeah. I mean, hopefully this is a little bit brighter. I know. I feel like we, we have to like play with it a little bit more, but that's okay. We'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. Yeah. Well, I mean, it's better than what we are. We're right. Making steps. Making levels. Mm -hmm. Levels is levels to me. It's levels. Um, so, uh, welcome to another episode of Taking the Stage. I'm uh, the math guy, Steve. This is... Pagey, babe. Pagey, wagey, pagey, babe. Yes. Okay. All right. Okay. So... Um, babe, uh, how was your day? How, 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 what, what's, what's the news of the day? Of the, the week? news of the day was, I mean, is, the news of today is, I'm feeling good. I mean, we are in a new year. Right, right, right. Okay. okay. And I'm happy. So, just trying to stay, you know, level headed. But level, level. Headed. Okay, <laughs> I, right. We have a lot coming up. A lot coming yes. up. A lot coming up. We got um, uh, feast days coming up. Mm -hmm. We got um, uh, the uh, finals coming up mm -hmm. and the semester coming up. And yeah, this is um, uh, gonna be yes. a, a good old month punch. You know, we're gonna, it will it be. It it's so I don't know. Sometimes it feels like a little bittersweet. A semester of law school is bittersweet. I think I, it a like just bit. I don't know. I guess because it's like that. Um, what did you call it? The um, <laughs> negative reinforcement. <laughs> okay. All right. <laughs> because like this time next year, I'll be done and like preparing for the bar. So I don't know. It's it's fast. It's a five-year journey, and you're a five-year uh, journey, isn't it? Well, you when you first started studying for the bar, I mean studying for law oh, school. Oh, the LSAT, yeah. Yeah, and then passing. Yeah, law school only three LSAT, years. and then three years into it. Mm hmm So yeah, it's been, it's been four years so far. You only have one year left. That's what I meant. Mm hmm Oh, since the whole journey since began. The, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. So. <laughs> yeah, three years of law school goes by very fast, especially when you have two babies. <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> yeah, two young ones I love too. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, yeah. Today was a uh, today was an interesting day. I um, uh, tried to cut grass today and blew my shoulder out. Um, I don't know. I was like, all ooh, the rough happened and was, tumble things you do on you know, a daily hear basis. Me out, hear me out. Hear me out. What you happened? You threw was, your arm out doing that. Hold on, hold on. So, my dad got me a lawnmower from this guy that we know. Uh, and um, this very old one, it, it don't have the 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 bar thing is missing. So you gotta you supposed to you know trigger rig it. Okay, all right. <laughs> we'll get back to that in a second. So um, I was trying to you know and then but I was trying to. But it's old, so I'm thinking you gotta put it. It probably just need oil. I put gas in it and I pumped it and everything. But it probably it was just a, it was, but it's old, so I'm thinking you gotta pull it and then you know. Pull my shoulder. Anywho, anywho, okay. You can steve your way through it. I, I, not how I break know, it man. until you fix it. Hold on a second. Ain't even that's what you like do. That. He ain't gonna call me out like that. That's unnecessary. Okay. Anywho, I'm pretty sure all the people who listen to this know exactly what I'm talking about. That's not. <laughs> hold on. Hold on. Now. 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 I, I'm. I've calmed down quite a bit. Uh, they, they, they can see your face, Paige. We, oh, it's, 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 on, it's on the joke. Okay. Okay. Anywho, <laughs> um, <laughs> so uh, what I wanted us to talk about today is, <clears throat> oh, yeah. let's start with um, this phrase. This is a phrase that you said recently. 
podcast. And we're just gonna talk about just phrases, just 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 phrases. Phrases. That's that's gonna be the. I might I might title it phrases. I ain't gonna hold you. Okay. Um. But um. Here's a phrase that you said uh, recently. Mm-hmm. Uh, um. I want you to recall uh, the context, possible context in which you said it. Oh, so this is like you're gonna give him the phrase and I have to recall like well. just just bear with me. Oh okay. Lions, tigers, or bear with me. <laughs> oh, oh my. Okay, anywho. Wow. Um The phrase was You some cheeky. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, okay. Page me for for what Okay, why did you say this phrase? Any any thoughts of why you may have said this phrase? <laughs> I grew up saying that. And honestly, you know what? I wish we could like phone a friend because moms. Well, moms who? Which moms? And the, uh, the triple threat. My mother? They all know what I mean. Oh, triple threat definitely knows. You some cheeky. Mm-hmm. And you have to have your lips like, you some cheeky. <laughs> you have to put your lips in that, in that, in that fashion. Um, okay, what does this phrase mean? Let's start there. Well, that was just like a childhood phrase that we would use that kind of meant like, hmm, I'm trying to think of an example. It kind of means like you're cheeky, like you're, I guess, like not greedy, but like covetous over what you have. Like, selfish, you know, yeah, selfish. Mm-hmm. So, like, you know. If I mainly use it kind of like another term that I don't really like using, but I kind of use it where it's like if like I have something, I give you some of it, and then yeah. I'm about to say then you cheeky with it. <laughs> then you don't want to give it to somebody else or something like that. <laughs> or like if I'm like, oh, okay, well, not like this much, but. You know, it's like she what? said nothing. She said I nothing. Y'all am. heard? Y'all heard her say nothing, you, right? You say this every time, but you always understand how I'm trying to. I know exactly what you're trying to say. That don't mean everybody was trying to say. That's the whole point of the podcast. Goodness. It's like stop being so cheeky with things. Like stop being so like tight mm-hmm. with it. Tight, basically. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Well, okay. Selfish. Yeah. Co- co- covetedness, or or even. Mm-hmm. Um, uh. uh as um, the dad from uh, uh everybody hates Chris. What's his name? Uh, Ju- uh, Ju- uh, Julius. Julius. <laughs> My man. Don't, don't be Julius or or or, mm-hmm. um, or um from the game. The red skin dude. The light skin dude. What was his name? I don't remember. I, I don't know remember. you're talking about though. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Uh, but anyway, yes. Okay, so but that's okay. So that's what uh, you some cheeky. That's one of them. But what I wanted to talk about is uh, we we touched about it a little bit on this um in our um. Uh, we had a party just about, you know, are you black enough, quote unquote. That mm-hmm. was that was the, the the theme of it, I guess, or the the, the topic. And yeah. so, but uh, this time specifically, uh, I want to talk about our vernacular. Okay. Um, just about um how we talk or how we speak. Mm-hmm. Um, uh, just about you know th- things of that nature. And so, um, especially with both of us coming from, um, uh. Um, diverse background. That, 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 that's, that's, yes. that's, 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 that's the vernacular. Yeah, that, we'll see. Well, 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 well. There we go. Verbiage, verbiage. Okay. All right. Okay. Um, um, mm-hmm. uh, very diverse background. Um, uh, private school. Um, uh, got a master's degree in law school. Um, uh, um, works, or uh, sorry, a master's degree. Works in, uh, well, sorry, Franklin, during their private Mm-hmm. Um, uh, uh, got a master's degree, works in education, uh, works in a, a STEM field. Oh, higher ed, STEM, yeah. Yeah, not quite, you know. So anyway, so um, just the vernacular that we use and, and, and um, just different um, phrases that we may use or say or the, the way that we speak. So all, all like And then all of that is completely different from how we are personally. Oh, yeah. Y'all getting the rawest version. I ain't going to hold it. I am going to say, that's like in a professional setting, but outside of that, Child, y'all be about to like wrecking me to death. What you talking? 
Who is y'all and what are your references? You, your father, and your brother. We be what? How we be, what? How we be talking? Be speaking? Be, be, <laughs> what's your yeah, reference? Be reckon, be, what is reckon? The reckon, the over yonder, and the. Uh, oh, reckon. Yeah. Oh, okay. I didn't even put that on. And what's the other one? Over yonder way. What you talking about? No, the other one. Oh, mercy. Oh, mercy. That's actually just from LM. That's just from he, he old white man, but that's it. Oh, mercy. <laughs> it that's sounds so like weird. a script. Anywho, okay, okay, okay. So, um, uh, first thing I want is okay, slang. Just slang. Okay. Just, um, uh, just different phrases that we may use slang wise or. Oh, um, look, we started off with the slang. Well, I, that yeah. was, I mean, it, it was going to be a, a natural segue throughout this entire thing. I'm okay, certain. cool. Um, but, uh, yeah, just a uh, uh, slang that we would normally use. Uh, so I think the newest one would be like the wrecking and all that stuff. I mean, I we've always heard people. Well, I know I've always heard people say that. Mm -hmm. And I think now being more out in the country at the church yeah, probably and stuff like slang, yeah. yeah, that's what they hear like or what we hear like Miss Martin saying. Mm -hmm. What's his name? I say L M. But go ahead. Okay, that's what we <laughs> say. <laughs> and so. You know, birds of a feather. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Which I think so that's just, how. Well, I think that's how we, both of us naturally kind of. Yeah, that's how you take on like anything. Yeah, yeah. And so it's like birds of a feather. So it's like, you know, he says that all the time. Then that like telephone game almost mm -hmm. sort of thing. So that's the newest ones. The reckon. And all right. What about Murphy words like you grew up saying or phrases you grew up saying? Like cheeky. I mean, I mean, I feel like all of those things. Kind of start the same way. You mean what slang we used to say, Ron? I was talking about slang. That's the, this is the word that's sitting right here. I slang. mean, those are, I mean, those are the Girl, current slang. You, you didn't say some cheek. You said cheeky, cheeky, black, cheeky, black. No, that's that is not what I said. That's a very New Orleans thing. If you, if you I know that I do say down a lot. Oh, you. I'm good for you saying that. You bad down. <laughs> oh, oh, time out. No, you going you gonna, to you gonna explain that. What does that even mean? A bad that's isn't good, like, or bad isn't bad, and then down isn't not up. What you... That's like extra. Then you have to explain extra. You know that, right? You, you can't just leave it at that's that's extra. Like extra as in like to the extreme, like then I have to explain bad. Yeah. That's I, as I, if me have like you <laughs> Go ahead. I thought I was one of the kids. Um his pillow stuff button. Yes, it's still one. Okay. No, explain bad. Okay. No, I was explaining down. No, no, then you say then I gotta explain bad. And then it's down bad. Goodness. Anywho. But I was explaining it down as in like if I would say like you're like cheeky down. No, you was playing like you were saying down bound, bad. Bad oh, down. Okay. down bad. Down bad, bad down, whatever. Okay, well, either way, it just means extra. Like, extra... I don't want to say ratchet. I don't really think that's PC. But, like... I guess down bad... First of all, ratchet, that's another one. I know, right? That's what I said. That's what I said. I didn't want to say ratchet. But down bad, we used to say growing up all the time. Like, that means... I wish you were do with you because she's so much better at explaining all this. Because Diesel is the first you want to say. Oh yeah, diesel, sorry. But down bad is like you real like grimy. No, but you you're saying okay, so you use that way more often. Like you down bad, like what like, you know Ooh, that's down like you bad. know what you did is not right, like you're wrong. Like absolutely oh, wrong. Oh gotcha, okay, okay. So yeah, the extreme like, version it's of like, okay, Yeah. I gotcha. Okay. Um let's see, any phrases that I that you know growing up, I mean a lot of times we just quoted like movies and TV shows, so it wasn't really like phrases that we use. Not that I can think of anyway. I mean, we all. I mean, you use a lot of the New Orleans ones well, too. New Orleans like, slang. Yeah. Or, or even New Orleans twang. We had an episode about I mean, that, your right? daddy just said chill in the sermon yesterday. <laughs> Over chill. Over the day before yesterday, yeah. And so yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, yeah, chill. I, I see some of those I don't consider slang because I guess I don't not say them right. And that's the thing, like, yeah. like even my, so like mm -hmm. in professional settings, 
quote unquote. It's like, of sentence. course you wouldn't say it. But I would. <laughs> That's the thing because, like, okay, so I'm a teacher. Well, there are some things I wouldn't that say, like, from my, wouldn't like say. to my boss. Yes. But that's I would say it in a professional setting, in in general, I would. Well, that's so, what I think in a professional. Oh, to my vault. Yeah, I guess. It's just yeah. So, so but I can't think of any off the top of my head. Um, even though I'm the one who wrote this down. Right? I'm about to say you asking me when about certain things. When I wrote them down things. three weeks ago. So well, how yeah, you had something to ask me about? You didn't have. Okay. I know you're not talking. The last episode I edited. I'm gonna put it here. Come on, I'm gonna put it on for this one. Okay. All right. Okay. Give me a relevant would you rather for me and then I'll give you one for you. Like tell us towards me. Would you rather? Hmm. Dang, now I got to think of something. Hold oh, on. you didn't think of this before? <laughs> mm. This is off the dome. I was like, let me just surprise myself. So it was time. You said, and here's a bonus one. Okay. You asked me something and didn't even have an answer to it. Like you ain't good for giving quizzes but you didn't have an answer to your own bones. So I'm saying. You so cheeky. <laughs> <laughs> See? You know what? Context. You know what? Okay. The next thing I have on the docket is well, what about Ebonics? Are those the same thing? And, and see, slang is what we use like to with each other or to each other. But mm -hmm. like Ebonics is more of what. Okay, I feel like well, sometimes we have our been, own slang. Like we say some things that like nobody else knows about and stuff like that. So it's like, I don't know. Sometimes slang can be universal. There are some universal, I guess, vernacular that yeah. all black people say. But also there are some terms where it's just like you and I use that nobody else really knows about. So Like what? Like, oh, catch me off guard. Um, not all the names we call each other, but... Okay, you have to come back on me. Mm. Come back to me. But but am I lying? Though? No, you're not. You're not. You're That's not. what I think, I'm like. Well, I think the 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 the, the um, uh, purpose of the exercise is kind of just for us to understand more about you know how we speak and what we say and how we how we say it and does it even you know matter the the way we're saying things. I, I think it's the purpose just to kind of analyze that for each other. Oh okay. Yeah, or into in the podcast. Or well, like as I passed or say. Yeah, that's crazy because that's it. Again, because yes. we don't in, even say that in editing one of the parties, I left it in there. Then I realized afterwards, like I don't know if I should have cut that out or not. I don't know. Right? Because <laughs> like, like, am uh, I cussing? I don't think it's a cuss word because it's not really say. Anyway, um, what else I got? Okay, phrases that we use that are I call it. I wrote. I know you don't like that phrase, but I called it. For you to have that after you bonics. I call it black. You have Ebonics in there. Well, so okay. I think the, the, what I was thinking about when I, again, going back to your, um, you some cheeky. Mm -hmm. What I was thinking was okay. Well, how do other people hear what we say and how we say it? Mm -hmm. And and are there phrases that we use sometimes? Like I know I have students when I'm speaking with them, I speak differently than when I speak with other students. Not mm -hmm. not like so, some black students than non-black students. Mm -hmm. So, but. Am I, is it code switching? Am I, am I changing my, the way I'm speaking or what I'm saying? Am I doing that intentionally or does that come naturally? That's what I was thinking about. And so when I wrote that, I was like, are there phrases that we use that are kind of, you know, I I said blackism. That's, I'll be honest. That's what I wrote on there. But I was saying that loosely, not, not just saying, are there phrases that black people use that other people may hear and just don't get it or maybe have to ask a black person later? Are there things that I may say or you may say that other people hear differently? Other non-black people. Okay, I know there are. Can you think of something else like that? I feel like well, if we're talking about like non-black people, I think that a lot of times, I know in my experience that I've come across people who hear how I speak and like they say, oh, you sound a certain way. Da, 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 because it is the cool switching thing. Mm -hmm. And then also on top of that, ask me how to like say certain things or like what does this mean and da da da. But it's like, <laughs> but look at you though. <laughs> <laughs> Your page wasn't supposed to go there, okay? <laughs> All right, okay. We're trying to go. But no, but I feel like, you. Yeah. What, like, if we're, 
you know, balancing scales here. <laughs> like, that's how it comes out to me. Well, and that's one of the things that I, again, also going back to, the, so that's one of the things I pride myself on in my teaching is that mm -hmm. I'm able to relate to and connect with a lot of different types of students. And so I'm able to communicate with them properly. Therefore, they can learn the lesson, especially yeah. such a complicated subject as math. They can learn it, you know, more efficiently and more thoroughly. So, but in that same vein, if I can communicate with them, I'm thinking to myself, but then that, I know other instructors aren't saying this. I know they aren't saying mm. it this way. I know they aren't using this phrase, these phrases or, or, you know, making these types of, you know, relatable jokes or whatever it is. And that's the thing that's kind of like, you know, sometimes when I'm talking to people, it's like, it's so unfortunate that, like, I know that you don't look at me a certain way. Mm -hmm. But also, it's very unfortunate that you don't, like, see how you come off sometimes. Yeah. Yeah, which is fine. Um, but I'm sure you see them. it a lot more, like, because you, you have time. more, yeah. I mean, working as a math instructor, you see it, yeah, you just see it all the time. You see it how... Especially, you know, upper ups in in the higher ed, they'll they'll look at you a certain way, or you know, you walk into a room and they're like, oh, okay, I didn't mm -hmm. know, you know. So you I mean you get it, you feel it, you know, you feel the the, the weirdness or tension, or whatever it is. Especially the way I hold my hair, and then you know, a uh, strong black man with a long beard, and and uh, he dressed, you know, just casually. Mm -hmm. Okay, it's like, well, all that's right. why you have to have a big, you know. And what about it? Energy. See, there's another phrase. This is what we're talking about. Mm -hmm. yeah, get serving my bladder. I oh. will take it. Because <laughs> I do not mind serving others. Serving? Okay. Uh, serving others? Okay. Mm -hmm. For who? For what? Okay. I'm just bringing a random <laughs> See? I'm still See, we have to put that in there. Put what in there? For who? For what? We're talking about phrases. I know, that's what I said. For who, for, I was, I was, and the other one was like, we just went back and forth with phrases. That's why I was like, I thought that was on purpose. So that's why I was pointing at the, you know, saying it's going to go right That's what I was pointing at that. That said phrases we use. <laughs> we're not, not going to put it on the computer. You can put it Okay. On. I'm it's sorry. Did I skip there. ahead on the segment? I don't know. Okay, let's see. Okay. Phrases that we use that are, and I, 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 I. <clears throat> I put phrases that we use that are, I call them white phrases. Now, what I mean by that is that these are phrases that we may, or, or terms that we may use that are essentially acquiescing to the white people that are our bosses. Do we have, do you have any of those phrases that you have used before? Um, or is it a tone that you may use or... Anything? No, nothing. You don't acquiesce. I know. You don't. You don't. Okay, because <laughs> just so you, I'm so glad you know you, lady. Okay, because um, I do have an issue with those the two things right there. Only because one, you're right. I don't feel like I acquiesce to, you know, how I'm supposed to be perceived. I guess for me, it's more of like. What does the room feel like? Mm. And I'm never really thinking of how I'm speaking. Like, I'm speaking to you in a certain way right now, which would be different from how I'm speaking to Mel or, like, how I'm speaking to, like, your dad or your mom or... And I think all, both of us are, are um, not multi-faced, but multi-faceted. Mm. And, and we're capable of... That's one of the babies. All right, but what I was saying was that uh, both of us are more than capable of uh, <laughs> um, correctly saying things to the people or to the the type of person that we're that we're speaking with, right? Mm -hmm. Whether it be our kids, whether it be our parents, whether it be um, a, a boss, whether it be um, a student, uh, whether it be a teacher, um, just the people that we're speaking with, we we're um, uh, we can 
uh, change the, our vernacular properly in order to communicate exactly what we're trying to say to them. Right. And and not everyone is capable of doing that. So that's all mm-hmm. I meant by you said you you know you didn't too much care for you know how I worded this or whatever. Yeah. Are, are, they, there aren't such things as white phrases and black phrases. I was using that jokingly or or hand hand and cheek kind of thing where it's kind of. Um, Tongue and cheek. Tongue and cheek. That one. That one. Hand and foot. Tongue and cheek. You know what I'm trying to say. You see what I'm saying. I I, I miss I misphrased it. You see, that, that's the whole point of the. That's the whole point of the episode. Okay. Um. But so 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 one of the kids did uh kind of wake up just now. So. Uh, Back down. So. <laughs> wait. Why you have to? Woo? Because it's a lot. It is. And so, uh, but during that break, I did. Oh. Um, close your eyes for a second. Hold on. I did okay, kind of look okay. up uh, um, a few online. Okay. Uh, of see. first, what they called black phrases. That's what that's that's how they are. That's what I looked up. Hmm. Are there black phrases? So one of them let's is. Let's see what the internet has to say. Let's see. Let's see. Okay. Okay. The first one is. Uh, <clears throat> do I look like Boo Boo the fool? That, 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 that's what they said is a black phrase. Now I haven't heard that phrase since I was a. Um, I know. Uh, right. Maybe the. Teenager, but probably when I was like a preteen. Prior, yeah. Um, that that one. Yeah, that one sounds good. Uh, but okay, do we say this one? I'm not one of your little friends. Now I've heard you say this phrase rather often. Sometimes I do say that. Uh, uh, usually to um, very grown people. Actually, that's the actually. I'm gonna say I don't even to my kids. <laughs> right. They don't have any little friends. Do I look like one of your little friends? Yeah, yeah. You said that. Um, I, I think, think my I main think, one is like, but I don't know you like that. I don't even know you like that though. You say you put the dough at the end. That's the New Orleans part. You oh yes, I don't know you like that though. <laughs> yes. Uh, another one they have is whose man's is this? That's yours right there. Whose man's yeah, is this? Yeah, you say bee? that a lot. Fam, is this you, B? Come get your homie, bro. Not come get your homie. I actually, what I say often uh, when I'm talking to. Steven or, or, or Joshi or, or Sammy. I say, my little G. Come in, my little G. <laughs> Wait, what's Sammy's? What? This don't make no sense. This don't make no sense. All of Boy, you are three years. years. <laughs> this don't make no sense. I know, right? <laughs> Wait, the other day, I just, I, I said this recently, but that, not on the potty. The other day, <laughs> Paige is holding Stephen III like this. And he and he's sleeping, and then he wakes up. I know I just start screaming. Mel has the headphones on, on the iPad jamming. She says, "Steve." She said, "Pull the headphone back, brother." Shh. I don't the know where back she gets on, that from. That is jamming. so like seventies, eighties. I don't know where she gets that from. Brother, shh. <laughs> What's the wink and a gun about? What's the wink and a gun? The wink and a gun. Okay. Uh. This is New Orleans. This has been our Ryan all day long. Let me call you back. I got to. It, it's nothing to do with calling you back. It, you did not have to go off the phone and do this. But it's just New Orleans. It's a I don't know if it's a black woman thing, a New Orleans thing, or both. I don't know. I know me and I do it all the time. No, the funniest thing I ever realized was. I know this is a New Orleans black woman thing, a New Orleans family thing. What? That when you're exiting, that exit takes about an hour and a half. When you're exiting someone's house. Not me. Because you have to continue talking the entire journey to the car. And that What's is it called? The Irish exit? I, I, oh, I have I, heard that that's phrase. That's what I like to Oh, do. so maybe it's not a black woman thing at all. Oh, I didn't even know that. Oh, no. Okay. No, no. I'm thinking about... Okay, sorry. What's the Irish exit? What are you talking about? Like when you just like sneak out without telling anybody. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. So, yeah. yeah, yeah. <coughs> New Orleans. I mean, the black woman, New Orleans, when I'm thinking about is the reverse of that. Yes. The anti-Irish exit. Oh, like the... Uh, uh, what was that on Instagram when someone was like, this is how they leave? Yes. It's like, oh, yes. And it was you like, get your plate, you gotta go around the kids up, sit by the car, sit in the car. you know down the street they had to, on the way, and you hang out the car, bye. Still trying to talk. Anywho, um, yes, you and I would do that all the time. Let me call you back, I gotta, um, y'all, let me call you back, I gotta go, uh, look outside to see if they got a car. Really? What's up? I'm cooking at dinner I'm talking to her. Uh, what we not finna do is I don't say finna, I say about to, and I say what you not about to do is. Mm. It's a little aggressive there. 
You said this. You gonna call me aggressive? Whew, okay. Just gonna scroll past the next one like this. Right? <laughs> uh, you ain't never lied. Oh yeah, I like that. Come one. on now, come on now, come on. And then this one I added myself. How your mama know? So oh yeah. How, how your mama. family know? How your people doing? Yeah, how, you, how your people? Yeah, 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 yeah. Mm-hmm. Then I uh I like uh, I like saying bro. Mm, I like bro. that one. <clears throat> that meme was popping when it was the first bro and the dude fell out like this. Oh. Never know. Um Yeah, we got we got plenty. We got plenty. I oh Mel's favorite from the uh, the end of Toby song. Choppy. Choppy. Even though that's not what they say in the end of the song. But what they say? <laughs> I don't remember. It's it's in the they have the the caption at the bottom of the. Of the oh, what? but it sounds like it's a child please. It fits perfectly. Right. So. We call it child please. Yeah. Um. Then afterwards, okay, while while we were still on break, I um. I looked at white phrases. They weren't. It just sound like something that regular people be saying. So. Because it's like not they white. Up, it's just things that regular. I know. People say. I was using again. The, Tongue in cheek, right? Okay, tongue in cheek. Okay, so um, uh, but that's because we, since we're a minority, then it's considered well. They got black phrases, then regular phrases, and whatever. Anyway, okay. The next thing I had on the docket was okay. We are very much so, as we've pointed out on this pod before, we're at the church way more often than most humans. So, mm -hmm. what about church phrases that we may use? I kind of feel like that's a little unfair on my side because you a church grandmother already. That's why. I'm, well, not well. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> it's just I grew up around that. So did every other. But like you don't say. What's the same that? Enough thing? going on the pot. It's Steven. gracious. Okay. It's not even. It's just. Yes, it is. It's okay. Okay, okay. It's okay. okay. it's okay. it's okay. okay. it's okay. it's okay. y'all podcast. Y'all have to at least give me one yarn when we have to record the password. That's just that's just not true. They don't have to. And I just have to feed the baby again and put him back down. <sighs> she gonna blame the baby? Nah, it's the baby fault. Not blaming. It's an explanation. Mm -hmm. Now watch when she's not even feeding no more. It's gonna be like, well, you know, I got two churn. When the sun is shining outside, we got us a babysitter. We can't shoot when the sun shining because we ain't got a babysitter. And I said, I said when we have us a babysitter. When is that? Never. You know what? You have the manifest thing. Mm, 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 mm. Okay. Churchy phrases is what See? we get to. Churchy phrases. <laughs> what you got? Um... All of them. Look, I'm trying. I'm trying to think. You're trying. Of you're trying to think. You wouldn't say. I don't know. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. mm -hmm. <laughs> don't worry. Wait, I pulled some up for you. I know. Wait, wait. Let me think. Let me think. I pulled some up for you. So let's 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 see if these gonna you know, um uh uh uh, I don't know if trigger, but you know, maybe help you out a little bit. Let's see what I got. Let's see what I got here. Boom, 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 boom. I try to press okay. Mm. Yeah, it's good. All the time. All the time. Oh, you See? caught me. You caught me. <laughs> mm -hmm. All the time. <laughs> and all the time. Yeah, it's good. Yes, he is. That's how that's how we used to say it in church. Yo, for the yes, he is on the back. You're trying to say that you're not. <laughs> that's that you're not a, grand, a church grandmother. What are you trying to that say? That is not? so funny. Okay, let's see what else we got. Let's see. Is there anybody here who can say that they... That's just a phrase that people mm -hmm. say in church, which is it's a, it's more of a preacher I'm not a phrase than anything else. Mm -hmm. Look at your neighbor and say? Why do you have to do that voice for all... That was my church. That was my preacher one. That was a preacher one. Oh, okay. Okay. Uh, what about this one? Won't he do it? Don't sing the song when you're trying to sing it. Uh, don't break the ring off on the head. Ring off on the head. Ring off on the head. Ring off on What's the actual phrase that goes with this stuff? Won't he do it? Yes, he will. That's not the phrase, Paige. What is it? Won't he do it? Won't, Won't he will? will? Oh. Oh, no. Oh, Won't he? Oh, yeah. You're thinking the actual song. Won't he do it? He said he will. No, would. that's not the song I was thinking of. I was oh. thinking of another song. What song? Um. This is when I cut out a bunch wait, of... Wait, like, wait, wait. Oh. 
Yahweh with, oh yeah, <laughs> Yahweh with, I know he will because Steven. he's, Steven, okay, anyway, uh, <laughs> put little clips in there, the that's, song. A, that's the Deedee Wilson right there, oh yeah, yeah, uh, yes. okay, uh, what about this one, y'all don't hear me, nah, 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 people say that regularly, and that is churchy, for real. Y'all don't hear me? Yeah. That's where it's simple. I'm trying to think of ones that like the past. Yeah, I put this one. I put this one in my mouth. Come as on. I ta- as my ta- as I take my seat. <laughs> <laughs> as I- <laughs> Wait, day tunes. Shout out day tunes. That was so funny. Day tunes put that in the song. Mm-hmm. He said, as I take my seat. Did he hit one more note? He oh. picked up that clipboard. <laughs> Can't tell him nothing. You hear me? Day tunes be jamming. That's my that's my G. That's a uh, uh, becoming um, gospel artist. That's my that's my G. Um, what else we got? Okay, okay. So on the docket. Okay, so that okay. Churchy phrases. Okay. I'm gonna say I feel like we say so many churchy phrases. I'm, I'm sure. Just... And and what's what's gonna happen is what's happened in previous episodes is that in the next episode we're gonna start off with that. Like, right. That's like I forgot circle to back. say boom boom boom. Mm-hmm. You know. Uh, I put it in here. Okay, so we're talking about our vernacular. We're talking about you know things that we say, things that we how we communicate. I put it in here, words that we've eliminated from our diction recently. Any words you've eliminated from your diction? I'll start with, I try not to curse. I was about to say that too. We have, I haven't cursed but in I quite a while, talk, but the curse I just is a about little... That. We had a conversation about that the other day. Not you and I, but me yeah. and like some other people. Mm-hmm. We had a conversation about how we either eliminated or were eliminating or trying to eliminate like all of that in that realm. Well, that, that, that's the critical thing for me is that it's a little, especially growing up in the church, but then you still grow up in New Orleans. It's a little hazy to me. What okay? So certain words we know are curse words. Mm. There's other words not so much. So it's kind of and also there's words that people just don't like. Mm-hmm. Like um, I say the N word, you don't say the N word, yeah. that type of thing. So um, it's just a little like I don't say the A word. But that's in the King James Version of the Bible. Mm-hmm. Okay, so so there's certain words that's just kind of you know, a little flimsy yeah. um, on that. But I try to eliminate. I try to eliminate them as much as possible for sure. But it's a lot easier like with the kids. Well, you just don't well, want them to hear that was that was on the docket. So I'm glad oh, okay. okay. Um, words that we don't say anymore, um, or we don't say around our kids. That's what I put. Mm-hmm. What are, yeah, words that we don't say around? I mean, uh, cursing. Well, you of course. Mean, what are the words? But oh. I mean, but there's other like phrases like. Um, we said in the reason with, uh, don't p- pick up your drawers. Well, we try not to say drawers. We you can't your underwear. <laughs> your underwear. I am good for saying that. Um, or, you know, or, um, or like, um, lie, we, lie, shut mm-hmm. up. Yeah, shut up. Um, we don't say that at all. For a week straight, Mel kept saying whatever. Oh, I, I, it's whatever. It's whatever. Oh, what it's not gonna be is whatever. Like, That's what girl, it's not gonna be. You okay? barely know how to say that word. <laughs> yeah. Um. So I mean, we, we're just uh, trying to be particular. Try to be careful. Yeah. With I think that only gives her ammunition, though. Like even when we say stuff like "hush," she immediately goes, "Don't tell Melody hush." Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, she did that the past week or so. Too. Don't tell don't, Melody. Don't be tell quiet. Melody to. I'm like. Don't tell Melody is not stop whatever. Stop talking back to me. I know that. Much. Yeah. Oh my goodness. The three major. I am just like not prepared. Um. Okay. But so so so. Last thing I had on here. Well, actually, that was the last one. The kids one. But the one I had before that was. But also in eliminating words, there are certain things that like I won't say in front in front of our parents at all too. Well, Paige, this is called a natural segue. Oh. And oh, that was wait. the last thing. <laughs> One of the things that we don't say in front of our parents or grandparents, Look, for that see, matter. That just means we're here. We're, we're here. here. We're here. We uh, see each other. I see, I see you see me. We see each other. Okay. <laughs> um, what are phrases that we uh, uh, don't say or words that we don't say in front of our parents? Also, uh, a lot of them. Um, a lot of, all the curse words. I know I don't, I don't curse in front of my mama. I don't curse in front of your parents. Well, it depends, okay? Because if I'm talking to... Okay, I don't you curse in front of your time. dad. Yeah. But, like, if I'm talking to moms and we're who is, having... Who is what in your phone? Bae. Bae in your phone. <laughs> 
She is being my phone. Find a mom if you have your moment. You know, she said she said you know, she, you know, she wants her own her. episode. She said we try to just hit Just because her. we talk about her. Right. And she said she gotta come defend herself. Hmm. Are you serious? Anywho. Go ahead. Come on, babe. Got a spot for you. I am your husband. I am babe. <laughs> Thank you very much. In, but, in your phone, I'm booby. You are. And she babe. Wait, and she in caps. So, you have an emoji? She don't have an emoji? Continue with your print. <laughs> but, um, I will, like, I'll say certain things in front of her, but for the most part, I won't. Well, one, I don't really curse that much anyway. Well, now, like, I... Specify now. <laughs> I said now. I mean, it's not like when I was like 18, 19, like early 20s or what, mid 20s or whatever. But I. Now still, that you're. There's still certain now things. Now that you're what age? Older than that. <laughs> 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 there's still certain things I just would not say like in front of them. But there are certain things that I do say in front of her that. The drink? Huh? <laughs> Deuce. Deuce. Oh, <laughs> I was so confused. Like, what? Deuce, deuce, deuce. Really? Proceed. But there are certain things that I will say in front of, look, will say, not do say. Hard eye roll. I don't know if you get those body. But there are certain things that I will say in front of her when we're having like girl talk that I normally wouldn't say. Like, she lets me get away with, like, a little bit more. Yeah, and there are words that I, I, I don't be, again, I don't be cussing like that anyway. So yeah. I, well, not no more. I used to, I mean, I used to play rugby. I cursed a lot. I had a lot of anger. Um, played football. A lot of anger. But, yeah, I don't really curse like that anyway, so. Um, but, I mean, are there any other phrases? Like, I mean, I, I try not, I mean. No, not really. I don't. I don't think it's. it's sort of I know. Parents, I mean, I kind of agree with you. The only time I really feel like I'm getting beside myself to where I'm about to like say things that are, that I wouldn't normally say would be, you know, out of anger. Like if you got me messed up, then. Well, I think. Well, okay. So here's another time. Like okay, like when we're when we're at or in a service in a church service. Like there are certain things I try not to talk about or speak about. Of course, yeah. Yeah, and so those are other times where you know we're particular about our phrasing and wording and and our our addiction and our you know. Um, but I think for the most part we just don't really. I don't know. I feel like we we're kind of boring in how we speak. Well, that's the craziest part is that we just stated like <laughs> six or seven different types of people in our lives that yeah. we can have a perfectly good conversation with. Mm-hmm. And but it's always a different conversation. Yeah. With males, different with Stephen, different with you, it's different with my dad, it's different with your mom, it's different with our pastor, it's different with um, my nephew. All those are totally Cause different. Because like even with like Nathan and them, when like have. well, I'm just saying that because we had playing the go by them soon. But like even when we like Nikki and them, like we playing cards, like trash talking and stuff like that. Don't nobody really be cursing like that. It's just yeah. I mean, well, you or, just or even no. Oh, sorry, go ahead. What they mean by, like, the inflection and stuff. Yeah. So. Like, me, like, well, I'm just corny in general, but I was like, this mother sucker here. Like, I'll say something mm. like that, like, just goofily, but it's the same, uh, boy, you don't want none of this? And I'll slam a spade on it, <laughs> uh, you know, big joker probably, because you know how I do. But anyway. Uh, no, that was too much. That was too much too far. Mm. Anywho. Okay. Well, this was a good guy, but we got a lot. We got a well, let the kids go. They say, what the? And I'd be about to knock these teeth in. But they don't, they just say, what the? What the what? Yeah, you tell me, what the what? I don't know, to me it's kind of like when people say like, like how you say mother sucker, but you grown. No. Thank you for watching another episode of Taking <laughs> a Stage. Fine, we can cut that part out. Thank you for watching another episode of Taking the Stage. I'm leaving all that, girl. Leaving all that. Leaving the baby coming in anyway and all that. Okay? No? You not. Any last things, bitch? Bitchy wagey? Uh. No. I would just say I'm happy that we have a new year coming in. That corn is growing. I was so excited to see that. 
Because the kids got to do that. Like when we, we did like most of the little garden area. So mm-hmm. I like the fact that they were able to see that. <clears throat> oh, I, well, I guess that's what I meant to say when you asked me how my week or day has news been. Yeah, the news. Yeah, news. the week. Yeah. And. Green ears, I, green ears, green ears. Yes. I think that is it. Thank y'all for taking the stage. All right, sure. We'll see y'all next time. Have a good one. Hey, new lights. Hey, new lights. <laughs> Look, <laughs> they're bright. <laughs> hey, podcasters. Don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe to our channel. Also, follow us on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, and TikTok. You can also listen to our audio podcast on Spotify, Apple Podcasts, Google Podcasts, or wherever you get your podcasts. Have a good one.